I already have tree trunks. Don't no, make me put. Our uh, beautiful brothers and sisters, welcome back to another video, man. If y'all don't know me already, my name is Namir. Also, go by Nam Easy, whatever you want. Welcome back to the channel, bro. And today, man, I just thought, like, you know, so long, bro. I've been a bench specialist. People, so many people have wondered, they're like, bro, you on roids? Are you on that? Cause I blew my bench up so quick, as you've seen in the title, bro. I've been working out a little over, going on the third year, like two and a half years so far. We're gonna start diving into the little tips that I did last, or last year, on how I made that change in like four months. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. One of the main things that like I like to advocate is, I didn't really do as much, was definitely sleeping and recovery, bro. I know a lot of y'all gym bros going seven days a week, pushing iron, bro. That doesn't really work. It really doesn't work. I'm telling you right now, take a day off. Go ahead, chill out, watch some football, bro. Watch, chill with chill with the boys. You ain't gotta be in the gym seven days a week. That's the number one thing, because I didn't really prioritize sleep at all, bro. I was still, and the crazy thing is about me, nothing cocky or anything, but like my genetics are freak. I don't understand. I don't even know how I got to the bench I have now, honestly, with the way that I eat and sleep. Like during that semester, bro, I was literally, going to bed till like three in the morning and I'm advocating for sleep and recovery. Really just recovery. Sleep is very important, but I just say recovery. Let your body recover because if you don't let it recover, something's gonna happen, you're gonna tweak. I had a minor tweak in my rotator cuff while I was trying to get up to 315 and bro, it's just, it's just not good for anybody if you're injured. Next, eating bro. That might be, you know, in terms of the, the latter, the three things, uh, recovery, sleep, and eating, obviously drinking water, a lot of water, but eating was on the top of that pyramid. I came into that semester, uh, what did I come in at? I came in at around 195, I wanna say, that semester. So last year around January. Um, so basically like a year from now, basically a year from now, I came in 195, Bro, when I tell you I was eating, I got the meal plan here. It's my first semester ever at college. Bro, I went from 195 to measuring how much I weighed come, oh, what was that, spring break? When I really shoot up, shot off with the bench. Bro, I was 215. 215 pounds. Yeah, 215 pounds. Bro, do you know how much weight that is to put on? And like, what is it? like? I mean, I don't know if that's a lot of weight to put on in two months. I feel like it's a lot of weight to put on too much because I felt like a big slug, but I just felt like a slug. I couldn't really move how I used to, bro. Breathing was different. I was like, it was OD, but um, eating is the number one thing. Bro, if you're like 160, 170 right now, you're like, man, I want to get that 315. I keep seeing this 315, but you got to eat. When you think you eating enough, you not eating enough. Like right now, I'm really just maintaining. I don't really care. Like I said, my nutrition is pretty trash now, but um, you gotta eat. Like I don't like you hear people say that a lot, but bro, you gotta eat. It's just right now, like bro, I want you to pause this video right now. If you have dreams of benching, whatever it is, two twenty five, whatever, three fifteen, four, bro, pause this video right now. If you don't got nothing right in front of you while you eating, watching this, bro, pause the vid, go get you something to eat, come back. If y'all want you to eat that while you watch me pause and then go get something else to eat. Like, bro, you gotta just keep eating, bro. It's it's, it's not that hard, bro. It's really just getting gains really ain't that hard. I mean, you make it hard if you start throwing in excuses saying, I can't do this. Like, it's really not that hard. So those are the main things in terms of outside of the gym. And uh, oh, oh, one more thing. Programming. I was gonna go into this when I go to the uh, gym and talk about this a little bit more, but it might be loud in there. Programming was probably one of the number one things. I'll link the program that I used in the description below. It was a, um, since you probably know who Russell Orney is, it was like a it was like a power building, building like volume three, I'm pretty sure. I'll link it in the description. You gotta go into the gym with purpose. You gotta have some type of purpose every session. You don't wanna just go in there and be like, like the gym bro split, it works. For some people, I tried it last, that, uh, last year in the beginning, but once I got on that program, bro, I'm telling you, it literally, it literally changed everything it was a whole new game and i even did it now to what how i got um i came into last semester so september 2022 bro my squat i could barely squat 365 and now in january i'm getting 435 i just repped out 405 for two like all-time pr i could have got three you know, your boy was tired a little bit tired you know what i'm saying eating probably eating 
programming recovery uh, and sleeping and obviously drinking a lot of water in your protein and that's the main thing. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go to the gym. We're just gonna, I'm gonna show y'all basically, I'm gonna work up to like 315, like I said, might hit, hit it for two or three. And then um, I might show y'all like an accessory or two that I use to blow up my bench. One being Bulldog Bench, you can look that up. Also, uh, Lost Press. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. We'll do some, uh, we'll, we'll bench up the 315. We'll, we'll hit Larson Press or, or Close Grip Bench. Those also, I interchange those. This is all in the program that I'm gonna have on, uh, in the description. Um, Larson Press and then Bulldog Bench. There's not a lot of room in this gym, so that's what I'm saying. Like, I'll see when I get there. But uh, I definitely can hit like a Larson Press, even if it's all on the one bench. I'm gonna show y'all some variations you can hit, you know? Yeah, man, I see you at the gym. Nonetheless, you got warm up with the same weight. But like, I always went with a bar, plate, plate 85, 225, 275, 295, 315. Ain't that right, Luke? Ain't that right? Always gotta, you always gotta warm up the same, regardless how much you bench, always. Hey, y'all, this is my form. This form has been critiqued for two years. It's like two years worth of form right here. First thing I do, you know, just got a mentee lock in and I go back and my grip I put the outside of my hand on the I guess you could say innermost ring on the bench so I put that there and then wrap around obviously and then same on the other side and then when I'm ready I kind of dig my back into the bench and I mean obviously you're gonna want to put your feet on the ground when I warm up I don't put my feet on the ground I'll do it for this set here but like you put your feet out as wide as you probably can, possibly can where it feels comfortable and point it outwards and then you just pick it up. Take a deep breath in and then easy. Easy, man. Just like that, bro. You're doing a lot of talking, not enough lifting. That's the next tip. When you bench, you don't talk, you just do. I don't do not take your pants off. I have tree That's trunks. Engaged. I have tree trunks, so My don't play me. Oh, stop. Stop. Stop it. They're stop about the same. They're about, no, the same. they're about the same. All right, we'll let them, let them, we'll let them decide. We'll yeah. let them decide. Yeah. All right, bro, move. No one wants to see your pump cover come off, bro. Y'all, don't be like this dude, bro. You know, now we just want to lock in, and I'll, I'll talk to y'all when we get back to 315, bro. I promised them two, but I don't know, bro. Yeah. We're gonna see. You right, you right, I got it, I got it. <clears throat> Three, two, one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god, that's the heaviest this shit ever felt, man. Maybe I'm falling off. I still showed y'all proof that uh we can hit 315, but oh my lord, that was we're gonna have to run this back, maybe, bro on another vid. All right, y'all, these are like two variations I usually hit that's in the program, Larson Press. And um, let me show y'all Larson first. Set up kind of, but you know, get in position. And then just lift the weight up and then you're just lifting your legs up. So it's just straight upper body strength, literally. Press it up, same thing. Larson Press, that's one variation. And then the other variation, if you can even see, you might have to zoom in if that's even a thing on here. But um. Close grip, so I basically use my thumb on the inner side, I guess, and then set it up. Like, just basically just a closer grip. And then you could do Larson with this or just regular, and it's just gonna help build up your triceps and all that. And yeah, man. Heavy dips, when I did heavy dips, that definitely helped blow up my bench a lot. Yeah, man, that's kind of, yeah, that's really all of it. How I. Blew my bench up from 135 or 135 to 315. We'll say we'll call it 185 to, to, to 315 in like a couple months. Just that, those accessories, heavy dips, heavy dips definitely helps. Bro, that's it. Eating and all the other tips I said. If y'all want any more tip videos, let me know in the comments below. We got this thing.